Okay, that was written out apparently. Hi, welcome, welcome back to some more of the quarry. I'm gonna move the mic away a bit then. We are back in the quarry though. Last time it was, a lot went on. I got Emma killed. We found out the truth that Chris Hackett, I, I, I pretty much predicted it, but Chris is the werewolf. Um, it's kind of like a werewolf, but it's not like really a werewolf. We're playing as Ryan. We're on chapter eight. So we only have four chapters left. I've got through this game so quickly because I'm like so hooked and addicted to it right now. I'm just out for blood. We're at the pool house. Nick, Nick just shuddered. Okay. Where is Chris Hackett? Shut up. What a rude. Gosh, she murdered Kaylee. We have been over this. Oh, she's bitten, isn't she? Oh no. What do I do? I don't want to make him not brave though, but I want to get Caitlin's opinion. Uh, Caitlin? Sorry if you heard that. What do I do? Oh, wow. Real strong showing on the leadership front. I said Doesn't shut up. <laughs> what did oh, I just no say? Way. I am not getting involved. This is all you, buddy. Look, just think about everything that's happened tonight, okay? That's all I'll say. All this over a pony, you said you heard a woman. Hold up, you, you said you heard a woman crying when you escaped? Why? What do you know? It's the ghost story he told us about, right, Caitlin? This isn't a ghost story, it's a creature feature. It's really happening and you're all in it. Your bracelet. What are you? What are you doing? I'm not what gonna shoot. Her. I'm trying to help. Worst case scenario, this should give you a fighting chance. And this will kill them. Silver. Yeah. But what if it's Nick or someone? Like I said, worst case scenario. Path updated. Ryan, put that fucking thing down before you hurt someone. So, come on. Where does Chris Hackett live? When he's not at camp, I mean. What makes you think I know? Makes you I don't want to be I mean. That. Uh, you guys are counselors, right? You've spent the last two months here? Doesn't know we I mean we know where he lives. He's not in the storm shelter. I'm clearly getting nowhere hunting him in the woods. I need a place to start. I think that spooky house behind these woods. Ooh. Dude! What? Listen, there could be another way. Have you thought about that? I've spent the last month thinking about nothing else. Look, when the sun comes up, I am stuck until the next full moon. So is Max, so is anyone else he's bitten. How is that our problem? Why don't you ask your friends in the woods? Don't forget about She's Nick, quite dude. sure. Okay, any closer we're gonna have to spray you two with cold water. Ryan, let's just get out of here. I'm running out of time. If I can't find Chris Hackett, then a lot more people are going to get hurt. I'm going with you. What? what? Uh, yeah, what they said. There's no way I'm letting a murdering fugitive like you go anywhere near Chris on your own. Wow, are you for No, I didn't mean it like that. No. Fine, do whatever you want. You saw what happened to Nick. He was bitten. Everything's gonna be fine. That cop car you stole, where is it? Why do his eyes look weird? Why? It was a stolen cop car. 
You're gonna have to try and fix the minivan. Get somewhere safe. How long do you have? An hour or two? I don't know. It doesn't seem like an exact science. Then we better get going. It definitely feels like there are more favored playable characters over the others. Because we don't play a lot as... We're playing as Laura again now. But we barely... Belly touched Are you sure Caitlin. this is the right way? Belly touched Abigail. Pretty sure, yeah. Pretty or definitely? What do I look like, a tour guide? Have you actually been there before? I mean, no. Wait, seriously? I know as much as you do. How well do you know Chris Hackett? Mr. H, pretty well. Like you're pretty sure we're going the right way? When I first came to camp, I was going through some personal shit, and Mr. H helped me sort it out. That's really sweet. He's a sweet. good guy. You don't know him like I do. You don't know him at all. Okay, okay, jeez. Teacher's pet. Why are you like this? Look, I don't think anybody knows anybody, not really. Well, I know Mr. H, and, and he never hurt any of us. Well, I know for a fact he's not the good guy you think he is. All he does is try to help people. That's what his whole camp is all about, to help the kids. Yeah, I don't doubt it. You know what I have to do, right? I know. But only if we can't talk to him. If we can't find another way. I don't way. think there is another way, though. Lead the way. Like, there's only one way. But how was this even made? Is this to do with, like, the mother and the, the, the son? Silas. I feel there like my is. monitors have moved down. Like your house. I, I don't know. It's a bit weird. So, he lives in some redneck mansion with his redneck family in the ass crack of the woods? Look at this place. No, but it's where his mom lives, I think. Never been there, but... If we're looking for answers, it's probably the best place to start. So, uh, wait, how do we get there? What do you mean? How do we get to the house? That's a really good question. Maybe we just don't. <sighs> Look, I understand Chris is your friend. If there was another way, I'd tell you. Sure. Yeah. Laura. Chris is a good man. Okay, this isn't but about good yeah. and evil, Ryan. Just how can you be so certain? If I let my conscience slow me down now, everything gets a lot worse for everyone. Believe me, if there's another way, I'm all for it. She doesn't want to do this. I don't okay, think anyone would want to do it. There's a timer, remember? There must be another way across somewhere. I got you. Careful, it's gonna go. That was weird. Oh. Holy shit! Are you okay? Laura? Where is she? Where is she at? The water. It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. Oh my god, Laura. Jesus, Mary and Jazz hands. What? Here's a thought. Her eyes. What are you doing? Relax, look. Her eyes have changed color. What big eyes you have, Grandma. <laughs> no shit. Can you see yellow in my eyes? Yeah. Define yellow. Shit. We haven't got much time. Okay, I'm gonna just check because I think like 
something's moved this doesn't feel right okay so yeah i just moved my chair down a bit it's gonna make me like sit up straight but it's fine okay we're still like looking around is there anything back this way has to be they wouldn't like keep a full area with nothing in it or would they? Are they misleading me? Who knows? Please be a tarot card. <gasps> oh, ammo. Is that ammo? No, it's a chest. Could have ammo inside it though. Mine is lunchbox. Makes sense. Septimus. Septimus Lake. Septimus Hackett. Let me check that out. The forgotten belongings of a quarry miner abandoned in the tunnels. A letter of foreclosure within indicates that this has been down here since the 1930s. Can I read it? Dear valued employee, I regret to inform you that your services at Hackett's Quarry will no longer be required. It is my intention to return the site of the to return the site of the central quarry to an area of natural beauty by flooding it and allowing a lake to form in its place. Yeah, we read that um, that was a plan. You'll be played until the end of this coming week and then asked to vacate the premises. I'd like to thank you for your continued loyalty and wish you well in your, all your future endeavors. Yours faithfully, Septimus Hackett. Tight guy just can't pay us. Last time I trust a Hackett. So I'm guessing that Hackett's actually don't have that good of a reputation or at least they didn't have that good of a reputation i also like that ryan's following us now i think in all the other parts they haven't really followed us i guess nick did a bit with abigail but eh. like in the shop with jacob jacob didn't follow emma which i actually found really weird are there two ways to get up here then Yeah, there are two ways. Oh, there's a clue down there, though. Mining hackets. <laughs> These must Old have been quarry tools. Quarry days. No duh. No one's been down here for years. Oh, God. Creepy noise. Where is it? Where is it? These rusty old tools are leftovers from the Hackett's industry heyday before the mine's foreclosure. Okay. Very creepy down here. Oh my god, it's mines again. Ugh, oh, mines are the worst. I'm guessing though, you know that trap door in Chris's Chris Hackett's office? Oh god, ew. That Did probably leads that down to this place. It's her. And that's Who? probably how we're gonna have to get up the hag. because the of hag the path that we got. It's like she's warning us off. When it was like guiding us. Dylan loosened one of the, um, the, the like the steps. I forgot what they're called, but that might be a quick time event that I have to be in place oh, of shit. that. This place is Can falling apart. That? No, they can't have done. This place is not up to code. Mm -mm. I nope. mean, if the code is literally crumbling to the ground, then I think it's doing fine. Mm -hmm. Let's just keep moving. Yeah. Just keep swimming. Just keep. <gasps> Did she push? Him? Why would you push him? Oh no, I think he fell and she grabbed onto him. Although it did look like she pushed him. I think there's a clue here. Oh, there's not? Oh. Wow, it looked like there was one. Hello. <gasps> the lovers! Yay! I've been reading time. <clears throat> Just look at this place. Isn't it me? Wouldn't you think my collection's complete? 
I haven't listened to that song. Forever. Oh god, quick time. I definitely only see them as friends, but that was cute. I could really do with a hamburger right about now. Stop being weird. I wonder if there's a chance to get them together. Look at the stuff. Isn't... Oh, wow. Sorry, that, the, I don't know. The steps, um, I walking on the steps actually really surprised me for a minute. I didn't think it would like, actually have her oh step in each step. Whoa. Okay, so I think there is definitely a chance to miss a lot of stuff here. Ew, what the hell is that? Do you think Scott flesh? actually something is in here with us? Either that or this route isn't as disused as we thought. Ew. Evidence. A lump of what appears to be damaged or scarred flesh. That's disgusting. Oh, it's annoying that those exclamation marks aren't going. This was what we read last time, but obviously it didn't do it. Let me just check there's nothing missing here. I can't believe I shot the guy too. Oh, this was it. So Abby shot Nick in the pool house and he fell out the window and Abby offered Laura her bracelet to fashion into a silver bullet. So we could probably end up killing um, Nick with that, which I'm really worried about because I don't want to kill him. I wonder if, I'm pretty sure you actually, because he is in the vision, I'm pretty sure you can't stop him from getting attacked. I'm, I think that's way down. a part of the game, like a key point of it. Cavern, no, Whoa. cave in, do First not enter. Cave out. <laughs> Look who's finding their funny bone. She must be really small. I'm sorry, I still can't get over just how so realistic deal, this then? game is sometimes. What do you mean? The whole mysterious brooding loner thing, it doesn't quite fit with the I love my camp leader vibe. So I don't fit into the right box, is that what you're saying? What would that box and be? And what box would that be? Nothing, forget it. Do you always do that? Do what? <laughs> Uh, start to engage in a conversation and then just immediately recoil into your shell. Maybe I don't want to talk to you anymore. Oh, wow. Charming. I am assuming you're single. <gasps> yeah. Why? No reason. Hmm. I mean, him and Dylan aren't official. But... This way. I see a light. I'm yeah. kind of surprised, I guess. Or you can just hang out here. Up to you. That's loud. I feel like you could have spinach. jumped over that. So, you want to oh, go into a the collapsing nightmare tunnel first, or strong shall I? Strong strengths. <gasps> Ooh, so we have two tarot cards. Wheel of Fortune. The Wheel of Fortune, after all, fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. Sometimes you have to take a chance. Karma works in mysterious ways, but it favors those who pay attention. Watch closely through the wheel. Though the wheel spins, the eagle eyed can tell where it is going to stop. The lovers. There's harmony and disagreement, brought to light only by sparks of passion. Blood flows from the heart. You can almost taste it, and tasting it could save someone's life. That's very vampiric. <laughs> I wonder who's that's talking. Is that Abigail and Nick? I'm gonna go ahead and say that that's to do with Abigail and Nick. Because Emma's dead, so it wouldn't be Jacob and Emma. Oh, wait, there was something there. Was there? You see like glimmers of light in this game. You're like, oh my God, clue. And it's, it's not. It's just like setting you up a disappointment. <laughs> Oh, okay, this place is creepy, but it's really cool. 
One thing I would have liked though was for the don't breeds to be a bit harder. Uh, in Until Dawn you obviously have it where you have to keep the controller still and whilst it's a lot harder to do, I think it, it's more fun and in House of Ashes you have to time it. This is just like holding it and it's kind of boring in a way because it's like once you Careful. figure out like Hunters. you can release when there's no reds. I'm fine. It's just a bit like... Guess we found the party. Alcohol. No prohibition. These are run running tunnels. That would make that liquor almost a hundred years old. Probably still good. Good. Try vintage. Probably costs a lot. Well, I guess the hackets were bootleggers. Makes sense. I guess when the quarries are down, they branched out. Come on. Time travel later. Okay. think this is it? Uh, beach me. I'm pretty much completely lost. <sighs> yeah, me too. Shall we? Ooh. This game definitely does put me on edge, though. But it's not, it's not incredibly scary. I think Until Dawn was much scarier. And I feel like Until Dawn had like a very good up climbing. Whereas this, it was like, oh yeah, like camp. You had glimpses, but it was nothing too much. And then from like chapter four onwards, it was just mayhem. And it's been go, 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 go. Oh, they gave the shotgun back to Cape. Uh. What the hell happened here? Oh, they they boarded up the stairs again? Oh no, she did. Uh, that's kind of my bad. Had a bit of a tumble with one of the locals. The fuck, Caitlin? This place is wrecked. <laughs> well, you should see the other guy. What do you think happened to Jacob and Emma? Probably nothing. Oh, so she's talking about the hunt. I mean, should we go find them? Warn them? I think the safest thing. The most responsible thing is to try and get help. Mm -hmm. Right. And then we can come back for them. And Nick. And Nick. Abigail actually reminds me a lot of Ashley. I think they have quite similar response types when it comes to moments in fear. Emma would be Jess. What? Caitlin. Caitlin's smart, so I guess she would kind of be like Emily. Jacob would be um, Mike. This is a van. See, if I took the motor thingy. Oh, let's see what the damage is. Could just put it back in, they could go, but because I set it alight, it's, I think it's busted. Well, fix or no fix? Okay. So the engine's completely screwed. Yeah. More great news. I mean, if I could summon a working car out of thin air, I would. Wait, maybe I can. Okay, she's gone nuts. There's a scrapyard up the road. What was that? If we're looking for a vehicle, maybe there's one there? That sounds like a long shot. Dylan. Come on, look, I need you. We need you. Fine, okay. Once again, Dylan puts himself in mortal danger for the sake of his work friends. They are closer than work friends are. Also, I'm not streaming this. This isn't a stream. I'd kind of like to not die. By Dylan didn't here. expect that. We don't all need to go. I kind of like that idea. Uh, you're coming with well, me. Fuck. <laughs> Should I just go? Back to the lodge and wait. You know, we can't leave her by herself. Under the lodge, it's probably safer. It's not safer. Is it locked? I don't think so. Good, great. Head down there and stay put until we it's, get back. No, it's not safer. Dylan. Good luck. Are we 
really just gonna leave her by herself? What the hell? What is it with these people and leaving their friends or girlfriends, Jacob? Speaking to you now. Well, Jacob was caught by hunters as well, actually, so... There's not really a lot we can do as Jacob, although I think we're back to him right now. No, we're Ryan. And Laura. <gasps> we're gonna find Jacob. And we're also gonna find the monster. The monster. What was that? Huh? What was that? Oh, it's nothing. We got we got okay, guests he's downstairs. Out. We don't want any more blood on Is our that his hands. mom? Are they all related? What the hell happened to you anyway? Uh it's a long story, Mom. Yeah, that's his mom. You always got a long story. Oh, oh get up. Stay down. Okay, the basement. We're playing as Ryan. It's still only just coming up to 2 a.m. Shh. Okay, I'm gonna check what happened with the path update. A fool's errand. So due to Jacob's actions, the minivan couldn't be repaired, which was basically what I said. And then team building. This is a new one. A friend in need is a friend that bleeds. Teamwork makes the dream work, but the dream soon turns into a living nightmare. Dylan and Caitlin went to the scrapyard to find a working vehicle. So maybe we could just go as Caitlin then. And then the camp, where's the new place? Okay, there's the ex excavation site, sorry. The, no one's here. Though the main body of the quarry was flooded. Oh wait, no, that's, oh no. Though the main body of the quarry was flooded and transformed into the lake you see today, some of the excavation tunnels that run below the outskirts of the camp are still intact. The ground above these tunnels is compromised, but don't worry, we'll make sure your kids stay out of harm's way. Disclaimer of limits, trespasses, but trespasses will be reprimanded. And then there's actually only one more place after this to find, but it's the Hackett House. Yeah, the ancestral home of the Hackett family for many generations. This disclaimer, this property is off limits and trespasses will be reprimanded. Does that have that? No, it doesn't have that one all of them. Um, but yeah, there's actually only one more place to find after that. So I keep forgetting that I need to sit up. <laughs> but we've already found two tarot cards so far. Now we have found three. The, the Emperor. The Emperor, authority, paternity, structure is designed to topple. No, how the mighty may fall and their empires with them. Let them bleed, let them rip each other apart, let them rot. Can't believe I've already found three in this episode. There's only five more to find that we still can find, but I've missed a lot, <laughs> basically. <laughs> I've missed a lot. It's a hat, put it on. Jeez, poor kid. Head this big. Bobby. Who's Bobby? Is that the, the, the big hunter guy? Oh no, it's, is, is it the old man? No. Bobby's the old man. Caleb, I believe, is the, the, the big hunter guy with the shotgun. That, the one that blew his finger off. Oh God, what's happening? Careful. Okay. Did I miss some parts that I could explore? I didn't go down that way. Could I not explore that way? Now I'm confused. It's coming from a bed. These guys should be safe though, because they're in electrocuted Jacob. fences. Don't touch it! Oh! Ryan. Jesus. He's going. What happened to you? He's losing it. Wait, Ryan, don't. No, no, wait, what am I doing? Sorry, I don't know why I did that. I thought it was going to open Jacob's cage. Oh, for God's sake. Jeez, man, what are you doing to him down there? Well, that's nothing. We're just keeping him safe, just like we've been trying to do all damn night. What was that? Fucking hilarious. Shut up. I don't know why. I just panicked. Look, you gotta get me out of here, man. How? Seriously. It's electrified. Okay, um, there's a box in the corner of the room. I 
think that's how they're operated. Okay, I saw this old guy, under dude from the woods. He used that. But that's gonna unelectrocute the other fence. And she. Why are you here, Travis? You ought to be out with the others. Like I say, we've been all night long trying to keep those kids safe. See, they're trying to protect us. Ma. Uh. <clears throat> It's Kaylee. She's dead. <laughs> no. It's Kaylee. How Kaylee's Boys her granddaughter in right now. Now I know you got to screw loose in that cop head of yours. There ain't no way to kill her in her kind of condition. Silver bullet. She's dead, Ma. No. No, no, not my granddaughter, not my only granddaughter, not my Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, you goddamn piece of shit, not my little Kaylee, God damn you. That's Heath like ultra realistic. What did you do to her? I didn't do, he didn't do anything. Right? That was Laura who did it. Okay, so who's this one? Is this Max? Is she crazy? Wait! It's him! Think about it. Oh, Christ. Why would they lock him in a cage? Then who the hell is it? Who the hell is she? She's in charge. You've already got it wrong once. It might even be Nick. Your friend? Hey, oh, yeah. Listen. Okay. They said about him for they've already a minute. got two of us accounted for. Whatever that means. Whoever this is, they're, they're not going anywhere. Remember? We've got to be sure. You promised. Fine. Fine. You gotta get me out of here. Okay, seriously, man. They took it. They took it. You fucking idiot. Ma. God damn it. You fucking piece of shit. Hey. Get away. Get away from me. I actually really like Travis, okay? They're above you. I don't know. I don't know. Cause like, in a sense, if we leave him here, he's safe. Like he's, he's safe because he's in an electrocuted fence. No one can get to him. He can't get out to be killed. So he's safe. But if we help him, one, there's the chance of us getting caught, but two, there's the chance that I could put him in danger. So I, I don't know. I don't know what's the best decision to hear. I don't know what to do. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think they're gonna kill him. Travis might. I don't know. I think I'm gonna leave him. Not because I want to. Wait, look, can I look at the... Okay, wait, let me look at the tarot. The one in this room, I don't know, I don't think it kind of relates to the one in this room, but oh, let them bleed, let them rip each other apart. Sometimes you have to take a chance. Karma works in mysterious ways, but it favors those who pay attention. See, if we open the cage, that could mean that the other guy gets hurt. I'm gonna leave him. You're better off down here. What? I'm sorry, man. No, 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 come on. We'll come back for you. Shut the fuck you out, Ryan. Please, Ryan, please, dude. Okay, you don't know what to do to me. Come on. God, let me out. You can't let me down here. Shh. Path chosen. Oh. Oh, fuck. Oh. Jesus Christ. Oh, I hope that wasn't a bad decision. Jacob doesn't like you. <laughs> not my... God, not, not my only granddaughter. Not my Kaylee. Not my little Kaylee. So, you, you had those motherfucking counts. Yeah, honestly, that was really bad on his part. For two whole motherfucking months, right? And you are telling me now that instead 
of putting a bullet into each one of their little sorry shit-stained brains? Okay, maybe I should have saved Jacob. Your silver bullet gun and they shot my Kaylee with it? Is that what you were telling me now, Travis? No more blood on your hands. That's what you, you, you said it. Oh my god, we are way past that now. <gasps> Ma, what, what if it had been me or... Or, or Bobby? What then? She was your family. A good boy. I don't Protects like her. His family. You ain't no good boy. I wish I could take it all back. I wish I could take it all back, but I'm I I'm kind of surprised oh, that he's so I don't okay. Why you, you, you couldn't have just taken care of the problem he's not when you had the chance. Think. Taking care of the problem? Do you hear yourself? Yes, I hear my goddamn self. I may be old, but I ain't deaf. I'm a police officer. Oh, so now I'm blind, you motherfucker. She's no, mean. Oh, you just flashing that badge around like it's worth a million dollars. The only reason you got it is because Hank got killed in the gypsy fire. Ma. Don't ma. Don't ma me. Do you sit down, please? Don't you tell me what to do. Please. And don't you go around. Don't you go around like you better than everybody else, because you ain't. Would you please sit down? Don't you tell me what to do, you piece of shit. She unlocked it, I think. Yes. Gotcha. <gasps> Ryan, run! Ma, send Bobby down. Oh, God. Her beauty is a tiger. Be careful, make sure that she doesn't bite. Her beauty is inside her. That's why I'm leaving a Jacob a good decision tonight. When I say yes, you say no. the Hackett house. I don't know what those alerts are doing because I'm not live. So that was that was chapter eight. Welcome back. Did you miss me? Hopefully you've brought me I some have bought more you three. of my cards. Let's have a look, shall we? The lovers. There's harmony and disagreement. Brought to light only by sparks of passion. <laughs> Blood flows from the heart. You can almost taste it. And tasting it could save someone's life. The Wheel of Fortune. After all, fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. Sometimes you have to take a chance. Karma works in mysterious ways, but it favors those who pay attention. Hear me out. Sorry. Okay, firstly, I don't know why alerts are coming through. I'm not currently connected to my Twitch account through OBS, so I, I'm gonna... I mute them? Okay, I think I've muted them, so hopefully that won't keep happening. I'm really sorry about that. But if you're following go on Twitch or subscribe on YouTube, thank you. Hear me out, though. I think... Hear me out. This woman, Harem Scarum, that's her, right? What if she's the mother? She's calling for Silas, the crystal ball. P people probably have already figured this out, to be fair. <laughs> I'm probably like really slow with this, but I think she's the mother. She's the mother, she's on the phone, she's contacting them, and her son is Silas, and she wants the card back to try and get to Silas, maybe. I'm not too sure, but I'm like, this is 100% her. I have no doubt about that. I really do think that she, she, her son is Silas and she was, she's the one on the phone. So there's this. I miss something here, but with the sheriff's badge, Travis used his power as sheriff to help his family cover their tracks ever since the fire six years ago. Fire. Oh yeah. Cause, and it's charred. Oh, that's Hank's. That's Hank's then. Then love labors lost till death. 
do us part. Secrets can make you feel trapped. Perhaps a kind friend will free you from your guilt. Just don't forget there are worse things lurking in the dark than lies and deceit. Ryan refused to free Jacob from the basement. Laura and Ryan heard more of Travis and Constance's conversation. Jacob remained in the basement. Hopefully that doesn't come back to backfire me because, oh God, I can't deal with much more backfiring. Just whacked the poor mic then. Okay. Watch closely. Though the wheel spins, the eagle-eyed can tell where it's going to stop. The Emperor. Authority, paternity, stricter designed to topple, no? How the mighty may fall, and their empires with them. Let them bleed. Let them rip each other apart. Let them rot. <laughs> Details. Seymour. Then choose the possible future you'd like to witness. And watch carefully. I don't know Try what I and find some clarity. I want to do the case. lovers just because I want to see if it's about Nick and Abigail. So I think I'm going to go lovers. No. Yeah. Oh, Laura. Oh, it's Laura and Max, maybe. Laura and Ryan. Go. You still got time. Be careful now. I did actually careful. say that there would probably be a chance for them to get together and they did get the lover's card. So I'm thinking she's either sucking the venom out of him, sucking the infection out of him, or she's biting him and saving him. Have you been there before? Chapter 9. The scrapyard? Nah. Just seen the sign on my way to camp. What if we just, like... Walk to the main road. This isn't the main road? No, this is all Hackett property. The main road is another mile that way. Wait, how do I know so much more about everything than you do? Wait, shut up. So basically, it's another hour walk to the main road, and then at least another, another three, hour? hour walk until we hit the nearest whatever? Yeah. What was that? Was that was electrocuted, right? Let's just keep moving. So, Ryan and Laura, huh? Oh boy. Do you think there was something going on there? <sighs> yeah, there were definitely sparks flying there. <laughs> yeah, I know, but I couldn't tell if it was angry sparks. Or I like do prefer him with Dylan, though. Definitely felt like sexy sparks. <sighs> Doesn't she already have a boyfriend? Yeah, but Ryan's Ryan. <laughs> Something that they can both agree Not on. Not that it matters. Now that he's off on a daring adventure with Little Miss Mysterious, how do you compete with that? Kind of got close at the fire pit back there. Am I crazy or was something about to happen? It was always next year, right? <laughs> well, let's get through this year first. Okay, I thought they made the guys really tall and the really girls really short. Anyway, it looks like we finally know Ryan's. Well, I don't know. Confident. It's so weird. Heroic. With an eye patch. So pirates. Maybe she shivers his timbers. <laughs> there. Oh shit. Relax, it's motion sensor. Yeah. We're okay. Hopefully. I think. Oh, look, steampunk's back in. Ew, come on, this way. <laughs> I feel like there was more exploring you could do in Until Dawn. Put me down! Hmm. Easy, Ma. Put me down, you old witch! What your fucking hell! Everybody just relax. Please don't kill me, can't Travis. Shoot, but you can't see, darling. <gasps> the 
Doesn't she have a flashlight on the shotgun? Gotcha. Maybe that's Don't Caitlyn's one. What you did to my Caitlyn. Get the fuck off of me. What about what your son did to me? <gasps> Ew! Oh my god, don't just I don't want to see that. Oh my god, get it off! Everybody stop! I'm so sorry. I'm so- What the so fuck is going on up here? Uh, Babes, no, no don't. Wait, don't, wait, actually, don't. Darling. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh. She's gone. Oh, no, this isn't Little Bobby. Bobby. Marlon's gone. This is Jedi Jedi? Yeah. Who's Bobby then? Oh, don't stop showing me! Uh, I don't want to see that. No more party. No more protecting anyone. Travis. Yeah, I think this is Carl's actor. What? Pick up the shotgun! Unless Laura was killed with a silver bullet, she's most likely not dead. Oh, why am I doing this? I didn't. I... Oh, good lord. Ah, god damn it! I'm so annoyed. Okay. Alright, that's not good. No. No, keep it in there. No, don't pull the knife. But in stuff like this, you shouldn't. It's keeping yeah, more blood no, in no, than no. you think. No. Oh, oh. Plus, if you get into a fight and you need it, just pull it out and go pew. It's like your little own knife holder. <laughs> oh god. Just love how he's walking around with a knife impaled in him. Letter and a locket with someone in. <sighs> that was really graphic. I'm sorry. I'm not too good with gore. Haley's letter. I still love how he still has his earphones. Oh, he picked it up. Kaylee's letter of conversation addressed to her grandmother. Of confession, just her grandmother. I can't read it though, he took it. So Laura shot her in the head. Damn, he's shooting everyone. Okay, there's also another one. Pound of flesh. The final twist of the knife. A gift could be a curse or a blessing depending on how you look at it. And when you're losing blood, your vision blurring, it can be hard to tell the difference. And he chose not to remove it. I just, I know that if you're bleeding out, if you're stabbed and you're bleeding out, you should most, most of the time leave it in there. And the last one was actually the Hackett Scrap. Another successful family enterprise, Hackett Scrap, is situated just away from the summer camp. The proceeds from this lucrative scrapyard, along with your fees, allow us to keep the camp running to such a high standard on an annual basis. Okay. Got a new card. Thank you. I'm I'm not gonna bother reading it just because there's not really any point. Okay, that's the door. Let's not go there yet. There's not really any point in me reading it just for the uh the harem scarum mother to read it after me. So Ew Is that what they eat? That's disgusting. I also only think it's a f like not all the family are infected. It's only a few people. 
And yeah, depending on what Laura was shot with, she is actually dead or she might come back. Jump scare? Quite surprised. I'm just actually remembering that. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna look at the division once again, although I don't know if we'll probably won't be able to use it. Yeah, so she's binding him to save him, but again, depending on what she was shot with, that probably won't happen. I don't know what door then, because there are two doors. Um, okay, we'll try this one. Okay, fine, we'll go to the other one. Oh, he's looking through it. Oh God, no, don't do that. <gasps> Oh good lord. Oh good lord. No 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 Hide. If we block the door he knows we're in there. In cabinet? He might be going to get food. I don't know. I'm actually terrified. <laughs> He's locking in. He locked me in. I don't think I should have done that. I think I did it too 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 early. I should have waited a bit. <laughs> no! Take a breath. I thought I could take a breath. I didn't. Uh, I thought his oxygen was gonna run out. I didn't think. Uh, this doesn't explain it. Oh damn! You just saw me through the door. Okay. Cool. Hell yeah. Oh, this is Bobby. Who's Caleb then? Don't make me chase you, pig boy. I mean, they're gonna kill us now because I killed their mom. You do have to be very specific with the sticks. <laughs> I'm so oh god I oh, I damn it I messed it up You can't hide from me in my own house fucker You're a fucker <laughs> What was that Laura, yeah, Laura's still alive, I think. She wasn't what she wasn't shot with a, a bullet. A silver bullet. She probably is gonna turn quicker though now, so we gotta try kill Chris quickly. I don't know. I, it's not like I wanna kill Chris, but at the same time I don't feel all too bad about doing so. You know? Cause like Damn, they're ruining lives here. I mean, he does run the camp. I don't know. Oh, that's the mum. I think they wrapped her up. Yeah, she's not looking too good. I think all her getting shot did was speed up the process of her turning. Also gave her a bullet wound in the head, but you know, that'll probably heal itself. Hello. Are there any clues here? It's so interesting though the amount of ways this game can go. Like I am I'm loving it. I think at the moment I still do kind of prefer Until Dawn, but then again, I'm a big fan of like the first game I played. And like a pictures is like usually the one that I like the most and also nostalgia reasons. I was like thinking last time I wasn't a huge fan on these characters but I actually have grown to like them. I think we don't actually get that much time with a lot of them. I think in Until Dawn it definitely was a lot more equal obviously minus Jess but I love Jess. I just I just love Jess but yeah I think these guys because to be fair we do only get like a certain amount of time. I feel like there are more characters that they're 
characters that you spend more time with than others. So we've actually spent quite a bit of time with Laura. I mean, we basically had an entire chapter or two as her. And then obviously we're still playing her. And obviously we played the others for chapters too, but we had an entire chapter, which was like nearly two hours. So I actually do quite like Laura. Um, I like Ryan. Dylan's grown on me. I feel like there's meant to be something in here and I'm missing it. Uh, Caitlyn. Caitlyn I like because of how assertive she is. And she's not annoying either. I did like Emma, but obviously I killed her. Where am I going? Here? Jacob! I felt bad for, but then like, it kind of just turned out to be like, ugh. So... I'm not too bothered with him. Uh, who who else? Abigail? Abigail I did like, but then she kind of turned into Ashley, which obviously everyone has different reactions. Sorry, I'm like waffling right now <laughs> because I'm trying to- I'm very nervous. Um, and I'm trying to like not be like that. Do they know she's bitten actually? Maybe they don't know she's bitten. And that's why I didn't bother shooting her with a silver bullet. Um... Sorry, I keep saying, um, I'm really stressed right now. Yeah, but Abigail, obviously everyone has different, uh, reactions when it comes to flight or fight. And Abigail just does a lot me, remind me a lot of Ashley, and I'm really like that, so. She's not my go-to character. Let's just say that. Ryan, Ryan I like. Is there another guy? Oh, Nick. I, I, I don't know, I was, I was a bit indifferent with Nick. I think he's really sweet, but then he was awful kissing Emma. There are bears around here? When he knew Abigail liked him, so. Mm, I don't know. What was that? There was a bear hunting trophy. Oh, I missed two clues. Damn it. The spoils of the Hackett's hunting prowess who think they want to cover up the bullet wounds and signs of injury perhaps they serve as a reminder that these animals are definitely dead are those all sh shotgun bullets probably it's interesting that they do use shotgun bullets and not hunting rifles again shotgun bullets do have like a wider surface area but they would not know but i don't know i kind of forgot what i was saying i'm not gonna lie why would you play that? No. I do kind of want to, but that's like, you know. Tell them where we are. They use, is it a revolver? I think they use a revolver too. To be fair, I only really know what a revolver looks like from Joel. Not gonna lie. <laughs> that's how I can point out a revolver so quickly. I'm like, oh yes, Joel uses that. Use that gun now. Hackett family tree. Oh, I want to read this. Although I don't know if I'll be able to read the handwriting, but. The Hackett family have been around for quite some time. Their roots running deep in the local area. Christopher Hackett, Travis, Robert, Caleb. Caleb is the son, sorry. I completely like missed that. Yeah, so Caleb and Kaylee. Caleb's older. Interesting. Uh, Christopher married, is that Amelia? And there's Robert. Have we met Robert? I feel like we have. Obviously Travis. Constance family, Jediah Hackett. They married. Is Silas, can you see Silas? Sorry, I'm covering the light. I'm covering the camera, but I'm covering the light to try and see if I can find Silas. Cause I'm wondering if they're connected. Septimus, yeah, Septimus. Francis, Louise, did I? Oh, I can't see Silas. Faith, no, I can't see Silas. I, I, it's probably on there somewhere, but I just can't see it, especially not with the light. What's this? An invoice. Five thousand dollars. Didn't count as a clue, but it is something. Let me read it. God, why'd you turn the light off? 
These cages should hold Chris, Caleb, and Kaylee. They're all, all of them are bitten. I'm wondering if Chris probably bit them. When camp's over, they can keep hunting the white wolf. He's got to come back sooner or later. It'll be safe if we use blood. Last thing we need is more casualties. Is it not Chris then? Is it not Chris? The white wolf? Or is it like the OG? Like the, the one that bit Chris? And if they get the one that bit Chris, then everything stops. See, that's what I'm kind of confused about. What the hell is that? Oh, new card. Thank you. Howdy, darling. Howdy. Ah. Oh no. I thought you were shot. I am. I got better. The bitch is bit. A thing. Bit. Oh, Werewolf. You're gonna shoot me again. That Babes, that's so silver. Well last time. Yeah, so I, yeah. I killed her this time, definitely. Hey. You know, I might not have enough silver to kill you. Ooh. But I could sure make you suffer. So you actually need a lot of silver to kill them. It's not like simple. One like tiny bit. Sorry, I'm no so nervous. So nervous of doing it the wrong direction just slightly. I don't really want to kill him, I feel bad. Oh damn. Babes. Oh, light. Light hurts them. Run. I feel like if they get angry. What's your position? They get worse. It speeds up. And I don't want her to attack him because I said to run, babes. I said run. The light switch. I was gonna go out in there. What? We should have taken him. He's gonna die. No! <laughs> he can be with Emma. It's fine. Oh, good lord. Oh, good lord. No. No, 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 wait, wait. Oh, ah, yeah. ah, 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 fuck! Ah, ah. Whoopsie! <laughs> I thought he'd be safe. Hey! Everybody, fucking stop right now! Right? Shoot her. Take her face off. You know what she did to Kaylee, and she killed your mother too. Don't do it, Travis. No, I don't want to attack. Travis, Travis faltered. Maybe Travis does like us. I don't know. Swing chase. I'm so, if we're not getting a break. This is one after the other after the other. And I'm kind of loving it, but I'm so stressed. <laughs> what would have happened if we just went downstairs then? Would, maybe we would have run into Travis instead. Or maybe we would have met up with Ryan. He's gonna pass out though. He's losing a lot of blood. Although I do think keeping the knife in there was the best decision. What is that? My God, it's a bloater just gonna pop out. Can he even fit through there? He's quite like muscly. God. Oh god. It's okay. It's okay. 
Oh my god. Okay, I think we're outside the house. Although I don't know what good that's gonna do. Wait, we're in some sort of conservatory. I need spell spray. That was for Come nothing. On, you gotta help me. I do? Yeah. yeah. I promise. I won't tell anyone anything. No, man. Family first. Besides, I'll get in trouble. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I did say to do this though. I did say that you could do this. I you said it. Stabbed me. Yeah, fucking hurts, don't it? I ain't never been stabbed before. Oh, Leave me alone. Oh, it really hurts. Dad! <gasps> now we're bleeding out though. Oh my god, this is it! She can bite him to save him! It's me! It's me! What the fuck happened to you? Oh, you know, nothing out of the ordinary. <laughs> oh, Ryan! Oh, how bad is it? You're gonna bleed out. I'm so sorry. <sighs> that bad, huh? She can bite him and save him, though. I keep trying to fix it. Whatever this is, people keep... Yeah. You should have just left it. God's sake. Max. Look what's happened to us now. It's not your fault, though. <laughs> it's not your fault. I didn't have to come here. Also, he didn't... I if we made it you. so he didn't come... Is uh, that an option, you're though? You're not the boss of me. It'd actually be really cool if they had like the flow chart in Detroit Become Human just to see all the other options My there dying. are. He's lost a lot of blood. That's what I said. But it'll, I'm just... It'll heal though, right? <laughs> Wait. Maybe it... Maybe it will. What? Ryan, if you let me bite you. What? If you let me bite you, it means you'll be infected, which means. You'll heal. Which means it will heal. Yeah. But it also means. Yeah, yeah, I got it, Big Bad Wolf. Yeah. What do you do in this situation? Like. Ryan, I don't have much time. I can feel it like it's fighting to get out. If you let me bite you and you heal, she won't attack then him. Then. Have to kill Chris. You'll have to kill. It's not killing Chris. It's killing a werewolf. It's saving your own life. But she was and mine. We don't know who she was your bit by. Too. Or maybe she does know. But no, she was bit by Max. Let you bite me. And live to kill Chris Hackett. Or bleed out and die. I don't. Pretty much, yeah. It's your call for now. So, are we doing this or no? Uh, I don't want to kill Chris, but like at the same time. Let me just blood flows in the heart and you can almost say saying it and tasting it could save someone's life. I think that's basically saying like, bro, do it. Let me see this. Laura did not attack Jedi. -er. Okay. This one has repercussions. The werewolf killed Jacob in the basement. Oh, they're actually called werewolves. Ryan removed the knife from his wound and stabbed Bobby. Ryan had to be careful not to exacerbate his injury as he fled from Bobby. Okay. I think I did pretty okay 
with those things, obviously, not with Jacob. No wonder the deer population has decreased. It looks like most of them have ended up in that war in the Hackett house. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna accept. It's gonna be like that scene from the first Twilight movie where Edward saves Ella. And Carla's like, Stai, you're draining her. The infection's gone. I don't <sighs> like how they're pushing these two together though, because Laura's with Max. Like, That's why she's doing you. this. And it, I I liked him being with Del Dylan. I liked the representation representation that we got there. It, it's kind of annoying. Just a quick bite. No, don't put it away. It is like that scene from Twilight. Okay, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> she just has much more restraint than Edward, apparently. He should start to feel better soon, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta go. What? Uh, you got it. So I'm wondering if um, I didn't stab Bobby, Laura would have killed him. Because. She came in right after. I like Bobby though. Okay, the scrap yard. See, I'm just, I'm not that invested in these guys. I'm not gonna lie. I prefer like out, huh? Ryan and Laura. So, do you want to give me some direction on what we're looking for specifically? Well, most of these cars look like they've already been stripped apart. It's just empty frames and chassis, which doesn't help us much. Okay, so we're looking for engines? You can just like well, take an engine out. Intact. Got it. It's gonna be a lot to hold back, I feel like. Car battery, okay, fine, I get it, but a whole engine? Looks like I don't know a lot about cars, us. but I feel like that's a lot. Try not to make too much noise. Oh, right. <laughs> Anything about you? Not yet. Keep looking. I feel my face going red. Yeah, it's going red. <laughs> I I feel I feel when it goes red. That was a long time allowing me not to look. I'm sorry. I just could have hurried that up a bit, not gonna lie. Why are you following me? Get your own car, babes. Hmm. <laughs> Clues. Hello. Oh, hi. Strike pills. I don't think there are any clues. <sighs> Boring. Any tarot cards? I actually don't like the fact that you can only choose what tarot cards you can look at. Like, if I get three, if I find three in one chapter, I should be able to, like, look at all three. It's not fair that I can't. So, to be fair, I mean, obviously, if you go for 100%, you have to collect everything. But it doesn't actually matter how many you get in one chapter, as long as you get one, because that's the only one you can see. I mean, I guess you can kind of see from the um, descriptions on the tarot cards, but you don't actually see the premonition unless you choose it. Full moon, the 22nd. These sons of bitches had it all planned out. Yeah, they did. Why? Oh, it's the summer camp, isn't it? I was going to say, why choose that time? But there's also full moons all throughout the year, so... <laughs> yeah. Maybe they should leave the summer camp. Just sell it. Can't do that. Scrapyard note. SUV body damage. Keep this off the 
books and out of the way T is probably Travis this squad request to keep something off the books is a little dodgy to say the least there must be something there they don't want anyone to know about who's T Travis mm -hmm. looks like these guys were cooking the books a little <sighs> dodgy you said it I feel like that's a green button. I don't know if I want to press that. I'm going to have a little look around beforehand. No? Okay. I know there's the door outside, but I think that's going to lead us into a different area where we find the engine. Do not press it. Don't. Oh. Unlocks it. Okay. Well, we couldn't have got through there anyway. A documentary. <laughs> no. Shut up, Clint. Let's go. Ah, game. Bit similar. Caitlin, move. Oh, there's, there's so many ways to go. Can't even see. Okay, maybe this is a dead end then. God, can you stop? Hunted by literal monsters, and it's this is a scary. Okay, so both are bad. The thing is, I have I kind of try in my best to tone it down, like I'm very self aware when recording. But my scream, you kind of hear it a bit in the first episode with the car when it goes off the rails. My scream is loud, it's very high pitched, it's very loud, it's honestly like the perfect horror scream but it's it's so funny i want to look around for clues but babes i can't see anything i feel like i'm just going back on myself here i think i need to go up into like the stairs that we saw yeah this is going back on myself can you see? I'm still ill, for God's sake. Oh, oh, there's purple goo. Oh no, that's just rain. Never mind. Honestly, without a flashlight, I'm not going to see anything. Can't believe they didn't have any at the camp that they decided to, you know, pick up. I'm not even going to bother finding clues in that because, good lord, no. A shipping container. I don't know how that's hanging on. But this place is massive. What the hell? There are two ways we can get down. There are no clues over here. I'm just gonna walk around the other side because there might be a clue over this side. No, there's a tarot card. <laughs> Thank you. Where's Caitlin? She's behind me. Sorry, I'm so like antsy right now. I need to sit back too. I'm leaning so far forward. Discarded signal. What's this? Harem Scarum. See this <gasps> I wonder if we're gonna see the woman in here. Sorry, I keep looking over there, then I realize I'm I'm shrinking. 
Eliza. Is that the woman's name then? Because I'm, I'm like certain it's her. Torn and broken remains of an old sideshow attractions. The way they're entwined with the rest of the scrap shows they've been sitting here for a long time. Then Ryan chose to accept Laura's offer to fight him. He wasn't surviving it otherwise. Why are you going up there? God. Very scary. Oh, damn it. I was gonna try and go back, but it didn't work. Car. <laughs> I'm guessing that's the battery we need. So, what was that noise? You ever operated a crane before? I actually used to be pretty, pretty good at the claw game at my local arcade. The kids used to call me the grabber. No, no, uh-uh. <laughs> oh, yeah. Look, why don't you see if you can lower it down so I can take a look under the hood? Well, I'm going up there. Sure, yeah, She's staying sure on the thing. floor. Um, she should keep the gun. Just uh, watch my back, yeah? Yeah. I should have looked around before. I did try and go back, but it just didn't want me to do it, so. Didn't allow me. All right. Looks like somebody's mom never taught them how to clean up after themselves. I feel like okay, Bobby works let's in see here. what we're working with. This is like Bobby's feel. All right, not too complicated. What the hell is going on? My bad. Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> Am right. I actually gonna have to control it? Here goes nothing. No. Okay. It would have been cool if it did do quick time events here. But I also get that you can't really mess it up, so. You did it! Yeah, uh, I think I found my calling. Uh, about time! <laughs> well, maybe we can see if we can try and get this thing running. <gasps> Score! Why is it just leaving him there? Lifted the car while she was in it. What? <gasps> yeah, okay. I feel like she would have been decapitated. Oh my god! I got the quick time events I wanted, I guess. Oh fuck. Oh god. Dylan! Get the damn werewolf off the damn car! Oh, 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 Horn, noise. There are more though. That would really hurt. She just bounced effortlessly though, so gracefully. Oh my God, flame. They don't like fire. Torch baby, burn baby, burn. Sorry, I'm like shifting around everywhere. I'm so scared. Oh my god, it's after Caitlyn. Get, grab the shotgun, where's the shotgun? Maybe I should take the shotgun. Oh my god. 
crusty bitch. Come on. Come on! <laughs> Sam it. Boom. Go. That's so intense. God, that was so intense. Oh my god, no, it's not over though. Who did we kill? I mean, they're not dead. I don't think they're dead. I think they're just like out for a hot minute. Because only Silver can kill them. Dylan, thank you. You actually saved my life. For realsies. Yeah, you know, no sweat. I just can't wait to see who they choose. What? To play me in the movie about how brave I am. Don't push it. So, guys, can so you please just move? I'm very on edge right now. Brilliant escape plan. Okay, back to the lodge. Are you nuts? Better than being out in the open. Come on. How? They're not dead though. Who was that then? Was that Chris? Who's locked up? I don't know because there's Caleb. We know Caleb's one. Caleb's probably still here actually. And that was why Chris didn't want them to see or they were locked up or something. Caleb's one, Chris is one, Max is one, and Nick is one. Obviously Laura and, what's his name? Ryan are ones too, but they haven't turned yet. Summer camp, Abby. You'll learn how to interact with people better and you'll have loads of fun. I friends oh, oh, forgot about her for a hot minute. I'm so sick of people telling me. Who's that? Can, can we just have a break for a hot minute? Ow. This is, this is it. It's Hello? the, it's, it's the woman. It's the, it's the woman with the, the, the song is called Silas. There? I can't like keep my hands still. I'm so on edge. Great. Claw marks. Oh, What's behind her? Why is that on the floor? Oh my god, I'm sorry. The lack of flashlights in this game, the lack of light in general is painful. The Hierophant? Hier Hierophant? Hierophant? <gasps> I'm- I might actually have to look on this monitor because bruh, I- can't see her. Until Dawn was lighter than this and they still gave you flashlights. What the hell? I can't even see where I'm going. <gasps> this is where it leads down into. Yeah, I figured that. Huh. Trap door. One of them is loose. Don't fall. Just be a quick time. That's done something. Family house. Sorry, I just want to see what was updated there then. What's new here? The note is referring to Max's car. Of, oh my god, yes. Travis wanted to keep it off the books in case anyone came looking for them. Of course. And then the past, watch your step. This one was the one that was updated. 
the ladder rung broke when Abby climbed up it. So, okay. Um, Dylan and Caitlin went to the scrapyard. They found the working vehicle. They worked together to escape the scrapyard. Okay. Whew. They're still here? Oh, yeah. Oh, they ain't getting through there in a hurry. Man, this place is huge. I might need to rest a bit. You'll feel better soon. Cool. You guys don't have a lot of time. I'm feeling pretty good, actually. What are you doing? Stop it. Do you smell that? No. She wouldn't want to hurt him, though, because he's infected. Right? Never mind. Let's just find another way down. A way to Chris Hackett. Or just a way out, maybe. I'm done being chased and stabbed. Infected. Sure. And another way out. Fine. None of y'all are gonna mention that? Okay. You want me to go up to it? Okay. Good lord. Syringes. Huh. What's that? Sleepy medicine. We're on the right track. Stay close. <laughs> yeah, all the better. Can't I just knock him out of the, the full moon? Shh. Or would it not work? I guess they have, because they have fast healing abilities, it might not take effect. It's kind of like Captain America, he can't get drunk because his body works off too quickly. I'm sorry, what the hell is that? Is that one of them? Is that Chris? Watch your step. Can they not see? Like, can they actually not see? Oh, I can't get around there. What was that? How can you not see that? Okay, they're, they're chained up, I think. I think we found Chris Hackett. Son of a bitch. <gasps> but he wouldn't want to attack them. They're infected. say that that's a problem. <gasps> He's attacking Bobby. Oh, oh she's gonna <sighs> combust. <gasps> Travis. Travis, don't kill us, please. Yeah, Ryan, hide. Oh, God. No, don't kill Travis. No! <laughs> No. Bobby? The gun! What, what did that update? Okay, Bobby's dead. Let's kill your own brother, damn. Is it the brother? I think it was the brother. Or Jediah. No, no. Did I? Oh, God, he's dead too. Damn it. Okay. Ah, disgusting. Lovely. Can't look over. Can't look anywhere! Who are you? I'm sorry. I don't know what one you are. Are you Chris? Oh no, I think you were Laura. No, that's Laura. Okay, we kill Chris, I think. Damn, how did that work? How are you? That changes them back. <gasps> <laughs> Do 
Travis! <laughs> Relax. We can, we can talk to Sal. We, we can still save the others. It Do not kill Ryan, Travis. Right Please. Please. Oh my, that's disgusting. I'm sorry. He might have helped us, but he also killed Laura and I really liked Laura, so I'm mad at him. I, I acted out of anger. Oh, we're back. I found Paul. Welcome back, my friend. I'm so glad you're back. Especially now that more vermin have been stamped out. So she doesn't like them. Stabblers remain, but there's still time. So, then. Let's hear them. What more? Let's hear the things. Done. Shall we take a look? Oh, Laura and Death. Math. Death takes many forms. Max are on there. Good <laughs> change, transition, transformation. Often interpreted as a, a beacon for the hopeful. In your case, it means, well, it just means death. Thanks. <laughs> I don't think she's good. I think she's evil. The sun, the vitality of a new day. There's still time to wake up to the warmth of a night survived. Your choices, your actions, your very life hangs in the balance. It's up to you to find your path in the darkness and see the sun rise once again. Judgment. Judgment day is upon us. That's what you'd expect from this card, isn't it? Did you hear that? I don't know if my mind picked that case, up. It's simpler than that. Perhaps one's own judgment, a snap decision to make, can save them from their own personal day of reckoning. Every step matters, every decision tipping the balance, one way or the other. Take your time, think, and maybe survive. Hierophant. Oh. Where did you find this? Where did you find it? This shouldn't be here. He's been through enough pain. No, no, no. My poor boy. You see what that did to us? Oh. This is the house fire. Eliza. Yeah. No. <laughs> what have they done? They set it alight. What have they done? Ah! Was that to get her away? Who's that? Is that her son? I mean, her son died here. The dog boy. Is that like an actual son or like a pet? That looks like I think that's a Silas, That's a son. Oh. Ah. Oh. Why? Was it so they they'd leave? Why would they do that? Oh my good, gas canisters. Don't go near it. <gasps> she gonna get impaled? <gasps> so she can... She can get impaled there. What's the difference? There's usually flashbacks, but you can't usually control them because, like, because it's already happened, you can't, you can't die, basically. Oh my god. 
I don't. <gasps> that was Hank. That's not her son. Or is Hank her son? What is she doing? Is she poisoning herself? Oh no. So she knew? Mommy's coming, Silas. Mommy's coming, Silas! 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 So... The, the, so Silas... Maybe Silas is still alive, then. I don't know if he is, but... Huh. Do you not get the scene if you don't get the Hierophant card, then? The tower. I want that. No, no, no. My poor boy. You see what they did to us? How they hurt us. He's well, out there still, all alone. Each uh, full moon they hunt him. Armed with silver. Which bring to put an end oh, to the no. curse they inflicted upon themselves when they set my show ablaze six years ago. Stupid children. Little Silas. A little white wolf. The white wolf. He must be protected. Oh no. He must not follow this path. Do you understand? Remember how Babes, I'm gonna be honest, you've done nothing to help me. Absolutely zilch. Nothing. How much I've done for you. You wanna make a list? Because God, I have I've none. I've no clue what she's done for me. Because <laughs> she hasn't done anything. All she's done is made me choose between oh. visions. Your visions have not been helpful, my love. Okay. Okay, that's chapter 10. I'm gonna pause it. <gasps> Max! Oh. Okay. Well, she, he's gonna be finding a dead body there. Okay, pass. Let's check these out. Oh, I'm really annoyed about this. Travis killed Laura with Silva after she turned back into human. Really went aggressive at it there, Travis, didn't you? The white whale. Yeah, Ryan shot Chris Hackett with Silva, curing his line of infection. Laura turned back into human in front of Travis. So is Chris dead then? Because it doesn't actually say that he killed him. It just say, I mean, I, I don't know. Travis stabbed Laura to death. Ryan shot Travis. I don't know what would have happened if I didn't shoot him, but I guess we'll never die. Bobby was weakened and then able to defend himself against Chris. Ryan's wounds healed and he was able to survive the night. Uh, are there any more I can like add on here? Blooded collar. Chris Hackett killed the cat mascot on the night Laura and Max were kidnapped. When hiding in the storm shelter, he devoured Ian in an attempt to satiate. I don't know how to pronounce that word. His appetite. It didn't work. Ooh, is that that's a lot. It's a lot. Uh, I'm gonna leave that there for today's part, though. It was definitely something. Let's just say that we do have chapter ten, chapter eleven, and then also the epilogue. Because I know there's a prologue and an epilogue and there are 12 chapters. I don't know if that includes the epilogue and prologue though, I'm not sure. But, oh god, I can't believe that. I've been making all the wrong decisions, but it has been really fun to do so. When I was playing House of Ashes uh, with my friend, it was definitely us trying to keep them all alive. And it is fun, but I think there's also just a fun when you just wing it and you just, you just go for it because it's just like you you don't know where it's gonna lead you and maybe i have made some dumb decisions but it's it's been fun we're obviously playing as max now i'm very mad laura died she was like one of my favorite characters i think she was my favorite female even more so than emma but yeah i think my only fault with the game is the fact that i don't really care for like the dylan caitlin side of things I've been so invested with like Ryan and Laura 
I didn't care about Jacob. I, I think it's because of the amount that we're playing as them. If you play as a character less, you obviously are gonna care about them a lot less. Like, I don't care about Abigail now. I don't care about Caitlyn, really. I don't care about Dylan. I, I, I'm like, Ryan. I wanna say Ryan. I wanna keep Ryan alive. Like, Ryan's best boy right now. But everyone else, I mean, of course, Laura I cared for. But honestly, everyone else, I don't, I don't really, like, care for just because I haven't had that much time playing with them, which is really sad. But yeah, I guess we're gonna see how this ends. I'm obviously not gonna get the best ending. It is what it is. The, I think... The monster does kind of look like a mashup from the monster from House of Ashes, but also a mix of the monster from Until Dawn, and then obviously it's put as a werewolf. I, I do see the dog aspect of it, but it does more so remind me of the House of Ashes and Until Dawn creatures, so I don't know, but I'm going to leave that for today. Thank you guys so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed, and hopefully I'll see you in the next part of the quarry. Okay, bye!